mogelijk gemaakt door Almhof Proteïne. Hi. You're up. Yes. When I spoke to the nurse, she said you had a pretty rough night. You seem much better. I am much better. So, looks like we're going to have a wedding after all. I'll call the family. Kristen, wait. I'm sorry. I'm rushing things, aren't I? You probably should take a day or two till you're feeling really back on top of well, what did the doctor say? I haven't seen him yet. But he is releasing you. I'm ready to leave. I don't really care what he has to say. You sure you're okay? I just want this experience behind me. The sooner the better. I don't blame you. But everything's gonna be just fine. Once you feel up to it and... We can get you and Ridge back in front of the minister. A couple I do's and you'll feel terrific. Kristen, there is not going to be a wedding. What are you talking about? Sure there will be. The minister's at our disposal whenever you're ready. I'm not going to be ready. I'm not going to marry Ridge. What? Caroline, what's happened? Ask Ridge. Ask my father. Does Ridge know about this? Oh, yes. He knows all about it. I don't understand. No, I'm sure you don't. Look, I don't really want to go into this. Right now, what I need to do is to get home. Caroline, can't you tell me what this is all about? I want to help you. You must know that. I'm sorry. You can't. No one can. Caroline, does Ridge know why this is happening? I have no idea what's going on in your brother's mind. Yes, I'm inquiring about Caroline Spencer. What do you mean she's left? She checked out when? Well, this is her father. Where was she going? Did the doctor authorize this? All right, fine. Yeah, have him call me when he gets in. As well as can be expected. How do you feel? How do you think I feel? I was just talking to the hospital. They said that you checked yourself out. Yes. Do you think that it may be too soon? There is no doctor and no medicine that can help the way I feel. What are you going to do now? I don't know. All I do know is that I want to get away from here and from you as fast as I can. Away? I can't stay here, Dad. Surely you must realize that. Caroline, you belong here. And with a person that loves you more than anything in the world. Oh, really? You certainly have a strange way of showing that. I don't usually set out to destroy the lives of people I care about. I think it would be best for all of us if I leave. 
Caroline, look, I... I know you're hurt and you're upset. Just don't rush into anything. Don't make a move that you might regret. Oh, what do you know about me? Or what I might or might not regret? I look at you and I don't even know who you are. You can't be my father. He was someone who always was there for me, supported me, who wanted to do things that made me happy. Caroline, I do. But I want no, you to... don't. You never liked Rich from the beginning. Forget the fact that I loved him, that all I ever wanted was to marry him. All you cared about was getting rid of him, and that's exactly what you set out to do. You looked and you looked until you found something that would destroy our relationship, and you used it. I will never forgive you for that. As long as I live. All right, there you go. Caroline, please. No, you betrayed me. Both you and Ridge. The two men that I loved and trusted most in this world. Caroline, don't you understand? I, that's why I had to tell you. I couldn't stand by and watch you join your life with a man who would treat your trust so lightly. Don't you think that was my decision? Yes, I do. But how do you do that if you don't have any of the facts? Facts? Is that what you call it? That was my wedding day. My wedding day. It should have been the happiest day of my life. I was on my way to marrying the man that I love. How'd you ruin a moment that special for me? Caroline, listen to me. No. no. Listen to me, please. I mean it. Listen. Now, I know this was not easy for you to hear, but you had to be told. Why? Because I'm your father. And whether you believe it at this moment or not, I love you. But do you think it's easy for me to walk down the aisle knowing what I did and to hand you over to be a wife to some man that betrayed you this way, who's going to hurt you and humiliate you days before the wedding? My God, Caroline, if he's capable of that... Who knows what he would put you through once you were married? Don't you think that's between Ridge and me? No. At this point, I don't. I couldn't, in good conscience, keep what I knew a secret. I couldn't and would not condone this man's behavior. And I couldn't be a party to hurting you. And you would be hurt, Caroline. Sooner or later, more than you are now. And this man will stray again. I know his type. If there was any other way, honey, believe me, I would never have put you through this. But you gotta trust me. There'll be other men. I may not believe that now, but someday you will thank me. And when you find someone that loves you the way that you deserve to be loved. When that day happens, I will walk you down the aisle with so much love and pride. But not with Ridge. Never with Ridge. I'll tell you one thing. If it were me, I...